There we go. Oh, I thought I was loading a cutscene. Wow, this is a steep ass drop. Can you imagine if you fell and you couldn't get back up? So, here we go. I also have all the sages out, right? Yes, I do. Okay, good. Okay. Where am I going? Okay, we've definitely got all the corrupt monsters. Ow! See, the reason why I'm also glad I have spears is because spears are really good at, like, keeping enemies at bay. They, they uh, they are long-range weapons. Uh... Oh, shit, that's a Lionel. Alright, chat. First Lionel fight, let's go. I am, I am pulling out a better weapon for this. Ow. This is the time to use better weapons. dead. And so am I. <laughs> Damn. the fuck still I can't see him with all the robots in the way that's pissing me off my AI is actually blinding me I can't see dude he t barely touched me that I like dodged and went sideways yes that's what I want jump on you and spank you like a bitch okay 
Okay, I, I should have just hung the left. Die, thank you. Whew. Well, that's my first Lionel of the game. And I have that Lionel bow. I want to reference something really quickly and point out how that, that bow is going to be very important later on. So, this bow, this Lionel bow, has a triple shot, which means I shoot three arrows per shot I actually do. That will be huge if I'm fighting Gan with arrows. Can I save? I can. Run, run, run. Just go around them. Power of the Sage cannot reach you? Oh, great. Ooh, chat, there is a cannon. There's actually multiple different devices here I could use. Oh, shit. Yeah, they want me to fly toward that and then, like, basically, like, jump out. Okay. Not fighting that damn thing. Uh, go to this, get off of the Lionel shield, and do this. That sucked for no reason. Look, 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 look
Yeah, I don't know if you guys saw it down there, but there's that gloom hand monster, and I'm not fighting it. Yeah. It's definitely loot. More bomb flowers, okay. I'm glad I saved this because Gibdo is only like um, one thing and that's no fire, so. And without the sages, I'm gonna need items that produce fire otherwise. Because Gibdo's off and away from. Those would be really good for my arrows specifically. This is breaking though, I think. Yeah. How close am I? It's a mural. Yeah, this is where I was before. The exact original location. The prophecy. Imprisoning chamber. Oh, I see. He basically took his jail and he, like, made a giant crater in the earth where the depths are. Okay, so this is probably it then, because if I jump down here, that's just bitch just boom. I'm placing this last uh, travel medallion, so that way I can just get right here if I need to without having to do the entire thing all over again. <laughs> oh yeah. Now, now the Master Sword has got the 30 that I had plus the 40, so that's like a 70 level Master Sword now. Look at the engraving, too. It changed. All right, Ganon. I'm coming for your bussy. Cinematic jump! Let's kick Ganon's ass, chat! Save the world! I just thought it'd be funny to say that. Oh, no. I'm just thinking of ways to talk shit. The power of friendship triumphs again. My actual friends. Let's do this, boys! Teamwork makes the dream work! 
The Demon King army. All right, bet. Luckily, they're all just the Coblins, so this is more cinematic than anything. Well, except for the fat one. Ow. Spanking me. Why are you, why are you running faster than Necessarily a flurry rush because all I did was barely dodge. Still more of them. And the, the thing is, they actually have some really good gear. Now what? Round two. Unfortunately, they all have spears, which makes it harder to hit them. But I got one too. And one shots them, that's fucking insane. Oh, it broke already, shit. The good news is with a double handed weapon is they put the Blizzrows in stun animations and they can't get up. I want all the loot. I really want all the loot. Okay, what now? Hello? I was gonna say, where's the cutscene? Alright, Gimdos. Flying and non flying. Now, because these are Gibdos, I'm actually going to use the Ruby Rod, because if I set them on fire, then I can actually get what I need. Because otherwise I'm going to have to rely specifically on the Sages. I knew I had a good reason to keep this. Well, unless I miss. Actual real life, um, a weirdo girl here. This one's right behind me. Guys, guys, AI, AI, please. This one's about to eat my ass. I don't want to have my ass eaten. It's not as, it's not as pleasurable as one may, may make it out seem to be. Now, I'd like to believe after the- oh shit. I'd like to believe after this is just the Ganon part because what else would there be? That was actually a really good anticipated uh, dot in my part. I 
I'm very glad that I have a couple spear weapons, because that's the only real reason why this works. What type of bow am I using? I'm using my royal bow. I really don't want to use this right now, but it's, I want to save the Lionel bow for Ganon. Ow, 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 that's gloom. Can you keep going? Come on. Let the AI do that. I want to get the last minute loot. That gloom. It means but one thing. The Demon King is there. You're kidding me. Oh shit, it's about to get real. More obstacles in our path, but our foe is mistaken if he thinks this will stop us. We are fated to fight these beasts. Is this just a cutscene? I was so ready to fight all of these. This will be a breeze for sure. It is time, Link. The rest is up to you. Wow, that was actually really cool. I got goosebumps there. That was dope. That was actually so cool for how that, that was done. I was totally anticipating just fighting all of those. Here he is. How disappointing. This world should be shrouded in darkness, not bathed in insufferable light. These weak, peace-loving cowards running rampant. It would have been more satisfying to overcome a worthy foe. Regardless, I will reshape this world as it was meant to be. I will crush any opposition. I will rule. That is what a king must do. Perfect timing for me to read yet. You witness a king's revival. And the birth of his new world. I absolutely love Link sometimes. The silence sometimes works out in Link's favor. All he does is just go... Shing. 
Okay. Pathetic. See, that's what I'm talking about the dodging. That's what I want, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Look at that, chat. Look at that. Dodging is going to be the thing that throws me off. <laughs> See what I mean about the Lionel bow? Thank you. Blood surges in my veins. I am not even near the limits of my power. Yo, dog, calm down. Are you hacking or something? Look at his health bar. It goes beyond my webcam! <laughs> There's a whole bunch of buff Phantom Ganons. At least I can tell which one's real. I'm beating you ready. I can do it again. Fortunately, the problem is that main Ganon's focusing me. And... I don't think even attacking the Phantom Ganons does anything. <laughs> I damn you dodging. Trying to jump. I, I saw that ability coming. Uh I saw it happening again, damn it. Wait, actually, I have my uh Okay, he's just gonna keep doing this, which is gonna mess me up. Here, hold on. Oh. Okay, I'm actually getting really low. What are you gonna do about it?
Oh, okay. Okay, bitch! I try oh shit, that breaks my hearts permanently. At least I parried some of them back. Uh-uh. Eat this, which gives me full repair, but that's one of my last full repair hard things. Uh It's the dodging that's gonna be an inconvenience. Oh, everyone's knocked unconscious. Wait. Oh, my shield broke. Just mid dodge. Like, literally, dog. Okay, I was backflipping in anticipation that didn't work for some reason. That's what I want. Yes, give me the opening. Yes, yes, yes. Big crits. Yes, that's why I might need. You bitch, you cheap bitch.
not stand in my way! I actually pissed him off so bad, and he's such a sore loser, he literally is going to become a dragon, just so that way he can kill me. Link! Hold on, Link! Yo, Zelda, a good time to show up would probably be right around now. Oh. decide to become a monster just to be able to beat me. Like, he's full of that much hatred. It's ridiculous. The demon dragon. Dude, Link's hanging on by his tooth. Link, get up, buddy! Zelda! The light dragon! It's- it's- if you think about it, it's weird, like, uh, it's almost kind of like a religious connotation to it. Not necessarily make this religious people uncomfortable, but it's like, Ganon's literally pure evil and Zelda's pure light, and I'm just like the person in the middle. Like, I, I'm, um, uh, well, human. It's hot- it, like, Link can either choose the path of hero or villain, and Ganon and Zelda are the examples, basically. Hold on, Link! Alright, Ganon. I, I, I already made you become a dragon because you're losing that much. I'll kick your ass again in dragon form, even. I gotta take a chill pill or Ganon does. I'm just hyped. Oh, more cutscene? Just, is he gonna just shing again? <laughs> he just goes shing. I love that. It's even like Ganon knows. Now, uh oh. Ooh, okay. So, my assumption is... X is to jump off, okay. I see the bumps on him, I'm assuming I have to hit these. Uh... Actually, I'm gonna just... Uh, this looks... Like, it's a more chill final phase. I'll just stick to the Master Sword specifically for this part. I was hoping that Zelda would help me out here. 
He has, what, three more? I got this, chat. Come on. Let me let me let me know uh, if you guys think I can do it. Let's have some hype. I don't necessarily ask for it all the time, so I really appreciate because this is pretty damn epic. I'm gonna fall on purpose so it only catches me. This is just such a cool fight, though. This is a lot better than the Breath of the Wild one, hands down, easily. Oh, oh that would've been bad. Like right there. No, there ain't. Is there? Can't tell. No, I think that's just his wings. But I find it interesting how if I stand on the eyeball thing, I uh, I can't get glued. But his skin, he, he can. Zelda! Come here, girl! Uh, I think there's only so many left? I think every time I also break an eye, he shoots more fire. I'm so worried I'm gonna, like, clip onto the dragon part by accident. Uh oh Yeah, I don't see any extra eyeballs. I see that one, and then I assume I, I gotta break the jewel on his head. What are you? Yo, here, hold on. I'm, I'm gonna take a photo of your goofy ass. No, it won't let me. Oh well. Without tooling, though, this is really slow. Screen's really red. Yeah, it's his forehead. It's the gem. I got. I got to destroy the stone. All right, Ganon. You're done for, G. I'm coming for ya. Look at your goofy ass. Fuck that up. I 
win. I win because you don't have friends, Ganon, you loser. Power of friendship wins once again. That was pretty ex insane of an explosion, my god. Damn. That was cool. We did it! Woo! And I also want to mention, by the way, chat, is that when we watch the final cutscenes here, um, because we did the memories a few weeks ago, we get a bonus secret scene. So make sure you stay tuned for that. What happened to my hand? <laughs> oh, well, what the? What the hell? Where am I? Am I in heaven? <laughs> I'm with the light dragon. Oh, wait. <laughs> I had a feeling. I had a feeling. They were in the arm. Yo, can we... Are we able to help Zelda here? Yo, Link's got light powers now, baby. Yo, thanks, guys. She's back! Let's go! We cured Zelda. Also with the power of friendship. This is why being a good person is awesome. But is she dead? She seems like a spirit, though. Hey, my arm! He took it back. He, he Or he healed it or something. Thanks, Rara. Th thanks, Sonya. What the heck? This is so like such a lot of information. But it's so cool, though. And that still shot of Link. Yeah, I was gonna say, I I'd be tired to need a nap, too, Link. Trust me. You, you've already saved the world from Total Despair f twice now. Um, <clears throat> I wouldn't recommend falling, though, and sleeping. Oh, shit! I gotta catch her? <coughs> oh, shit! Alright, it's not over yet. We're pulling the Tom Cruise! Get her, Link! Yo, what if I just missed and pulled up Gwen Stacy with Peter Parker? Amazing Spider-Man 2 all over again, just for the next snaps. Get her, Link, come on! Link, you're right, like, you're at kissing distance. Hold 
Come on! For cinematic effect! And a convenient body of water is here to save us. Go ahead and save your princess, Mr. Knight. Scene. You did it. Oh, Link, you really did it. Come on, kiss him, damn it. But how am I? You guys have been through so much peril together, and at this point, with how many apocalypses there's been, there's probably not much no. people left in the world to I date, understand. man. I had been sleeping all this time. something like a warm loving embrace I woke up oh that's sweet they really are a good fit for each other though truly Link I met such wonderful people I saw Hyrule as it was. I have so much to tell you. So much happened. Oh, Link. I'm home. So this, I assume, is the default ending. But with the memories, what happens now? Find Princess Zelda complete. Oh, oh, that's that's funny how that they annotate that text, let you know you just completed the mission for all the completionists out there. There's really no way to do that without having it be a cutscene. So now what happens? Is this the credits or we have the last cutscene? Oh, it's the it's the credits first, then we get the cutscene. But I will just say this is Wow, holy crap, that was fun. If you guys don't mind, I just want to give some of my thoughts and opinions here real quick while the credits roll and then we'll do the last scene, but uh Damn man, that was such a fun ass game. And, and it's crazy, too, because I don't know if you guys have been around for, like, you know, a long time or whatever, especially given the fact I took a break from streaming for a little bit, but um, I played Breath of the Wild as my very first Zelda game, and uh, when I played it, I never knew what to expect, but it was so much fun that I actually went back and got all the old Nintendo consoles and the old Zelda games because Nintendo's not always necessarily great about bringing back all their old uh, games to their current platforms. It was it was such a great welcome to the franchise. When I heard that this was uh, a, getting a sequel, I, I was so happy, especially since it's like Breath of the Wild. And this, 10 out of 10, man. Genuinely, it's a perfect game because I love Breath of the Wild so much. And Breath of the Wild is... In, in a, a simplistic sense, just another open world game, but the the immersion, the story, the uh, the uh, the adventures you can go on were just so much fun. 
And then the sequel here, which a lot of people weren't sure if this was just going to be like a DLC. Um, they were wondering why it was just a flat out another game. There is so much content here. It feels like Breath of the Wild, but like the sequel. I, I see as much Breath of the Wild as I do a new game. And I can see so many people playing this for years and years and years. Because just the abilities in this game alone are enough to make this game so replayable. The Fuse ability and Ultra Hand make this game so replayable. It's going to be like Minecraft. People are going to make all these crazy things that no one's going to see until, like, it happens. And then everyone's going to be like, I want to do that. And so many people are going to be, like, trying to, like, make this game last and, and speed run. I don't know if they're going to do a trilogy, per se, about the Breath of the Wild games. Um... They very well might end here, and I don't even know where they're gonna go from here. But, uh, yeah, man, whatever next Zelda game is coming out, I'm so hyped and so down, bro. So, yeah, if you guys don't necessarily mind, we can watch the cutscene now if you want. I just have to see if I can skip the credits. Uh, skip. Such an impressive landmass can float in the sky. Just when I thought I'd started to figure the zone eye out. Everyone, I am glad I was able to bring you all here. I wanted to share this view of Hyrule with all of you. Whoa! I've never been this far up before, Goro! Wow, what a sight it is! And Zelda, you were roaming the skies all along? Yes, although I don't really remember. I never thought I would actually stand here again. This is only a theory, but... Raru's power of light, and Sonya's time power. For Zelda to transform back, they both must have channeled their abilities through you, Link. Oh. I see. I feel bad for Zelda. The last two games, she's literally been in purgatory. She spent a hundred years waiting for Link to wake up. Now it seems. And it is my time. Now she's like basically been through Minoru. across time as a dragon. Do not worry. You have overcome the burden my era left to you. You have proven yourself, and you no longer need me. I know I can move on, join Raru and the others, and the world will be safe. Sonia will be happy to hear of this. But Minoru... <laughs> and I'll let them know just how much you care. Thank 
lucky one. King Rara, Queen Sonia, Minerva, the ancient sages, they wished not only to save Hyrule from the Demon King, but for it to see eternal peace. I will dedicate myself to that goal. Now, and for all time. My friends, with all of your strength, stand with me. I am very glad I did the memories to see that. That was actually really, really cool. And, and, and touching in a way, I actually felt genuinely moved. I'm gonna miss you, Megatron. <laughs> Because <laughs> that's how I see Minoru, is just, just Optimus Prime, basically, just a robot. So I'm curious, if I go back to the overworld, Link's arm is going to be robotic still, and I bet you the last mission can be just infinitely replayed, right? Kind of like how Breath of the Wild was. I would figure it would just put me back in the overworld. Probably be right outside of Hyrule Castle where I look at landing. Or or just the main menu, that works too. Anyway. So yeah, guys. I will just say this is that thank you so much for watching. I truly hope you guys end up enjoying today's live stream. And if you did, please consider dropping a follow. And if you're watching this as a YouTube video, please drop a like, comment, subscribe, follow, and all that beautiful stuff. And whatever Zelda else holds, I will make more content for you guys. If you want me to, I can definitely make videos or streams on the DLC. And just continue it just for as long as uh, whatever I enjoy. Although I have to be a little bit careful scheduling-wise because school is coming back up. But I'm glad I beat the game before that at least. Anywho, you guys know that I care. So, yeah guys, I hope you end up enjoying seeing a, another YouTube video or live stream for the most neat content creator you guys are ever going to see. I love you all. Thank you so much for watching. And peace out.